Brandy Kreft came home Sunday from a relaxing vacation with her family. When she went upstairs to her son's bedroom, she saw something that shocked her. There was a very large hole that looked like it was from a bullet. It appears the bullet went through the wall just above the light switch and into the laundry room. My sons are crying and he's like, Mom, I'm not sleeping in my room. Fear turned to anger when she figured out where the bullet came from. We have found handful of bullet casings um, out in the backyard. And Kreft says it's not uncommon to hear gunshots in the middle of the day. There's times you can hear it in the distance, but there's other times it feels like it's literally right in your back door. Um, and in this case, it was. The gunshots, she says, are coming from a hunting club that backs up against her property called Irish Dream Hunt Club. We're not against guns at all, um, but we do believe in people being responsible and being responsible for every bullet that they shoot. It hit right here. She's hoping someone right will come forward. It's just unfortunate that this happened, but I can assure you it was not us. Jim O'Shields has managed the property for 14 years, which covers about 100 acres. I take it very seriously, and gun safety is something I'm real fanatical about. He says the Irish Dream Hunt Club is made up of experienced hunters who know better than to shoot within 300 yards of a residence. It's easy to point the finger and say, oh, there's a hunting club behind us, but you don't falsely accuse people. O'Shield says it's possible people trespassing on his property fired the shot. It went through this curtain, and there's the hole. Still, Kreft wants the club held accountable. I want to see it regulated. I want to know that the property lines are clearly defined, that there's signs out there. A spokesperson for SEDNR says a private property owner does not have to be licensed to run a hunting club. He says South Carolina has more than 12 million private forests, the majority of which are used to hunt. Brenna McDavid, WYFF News 4 in Fountain Inn.